Валерия Воложанинова. I study at the CFU named after Vladimir Vernadsky. I'm going to become an agrarian engineer. I do love Crimea. It's a wonderful and blooming land. However, there is a problem with water supply because of the North Crimean Channel cutoff. We have managed to solve it with the help of drip irrigation. We have grown drought-resistant gardens for the last five years. We use groundwater sources and new agrarian technologies for watering. Russian Crimea is totally provided with food. New greenhouses are being built. Animal husbandry is developing. The land yields a good grain harvest. My name is Selimia Bari. Bari. I am the fourth year student of the Institute of Foreign Philology of Crimean Federal University. After the referendum of 2014, we witnessed constant improvements in the quality of life. Schools, kindergartens, businesses, roads and houses are being built. The new airport and the Crimean bridge that will be open for train this year have already been built. And which is the most important way of peace? Nobody tells us what language to speak, what religion to believe in. Nobody divides people into indigenous and not. Consequently, we all live in peace in our country, in Russia. My name is Kao Demira. I am the third year student at the Faculty of Dentistry of the Medical Academy named after Georgievsky of Crimean Federal University. Fundamental medicine is always based on the principle of humanism. In times of hardship, physicians all over the world unite, willing to help no matter what, following the principles of neutrality and equanimity. Medicine was always given great attention in Russia, and to this day we aspire to develop the science in every possible way, improving our knowledge, relying on the existing centuries of experience. Here in Crimea, the Medical Academy, with all the conditions necessary for our university to be a good platform for the professional formation of future doctors and general development of medicine. Despite various difficulties, physicians stay true to their profession, whose vocation is in making people strong and healthy. My name is Mirash Leyman. I am the first year student of the master degree program of the Crimean Federal University of the Crimean Tatar and East Philology Department. To begin with, I'd like to point out that there are three official languages in Crimea, Russian, Ukrainian and Crimean Tatar. At first sight, it may seem to be too much, but not for Crimea. It is well known that there have always been multiple languages and dialects in Crimea. Anyway, Crimea is a point where the West and East intersect. There are four branches in our department. They are of Crimean Tatar, Arabian, Turkish and Persian languages. Furthermore, we carefully studied the European ones. Studying at the Crimean Federal University gave me both quality of education and excellent opportunities. I have learned many interesting things for four years. We attended the fourth forum of journalists from the Muslim countries that took place in Yalta. Moreover, students have an opportunity to visit the annual International Scientific Conference. All the above mentioned left the unforgettable impressions. And as a result, time just flew by. The only inconvenience for us, Crimeans, is getting visa. Sure, we understand there are some political moments, but to my mind, politics should have much influence on the human communication.